I was very young when I realized I had a gift for chemistry. My earliest memories are of quiet afternoons spent in the serenity of my parents' home, gazing at some newfound wonder of scientific discovery. I'm just not having you going down wearing that low-cut dress with all them men looking at you. By the time I was in my teenage years, I was beginning to see life as it really was, a series of illusions that only the scientist can strip away. I wanted to see this hidden world, to lift the veil and hold the secrets of existence in the palm of my hand. I had little in common with my father, my sister and my stepmother, and life at home was a stale affair. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please put your hands together for Mr. Dickie Boy. I think I'll make us all a nice cup of tea. But I tried hard to look upon my time there as an opportunity for research. After all, even the most ordinary item has its scientific value. In my bloody room again? He is. I'll kill the little swine. Dad! Graham Young, if you've been interfering in my private things again, I'll swing for you! Oi, get back in here, you!